Chapter 8 of Rainbow in the Sky, All Around the Town Pokey tried to find a place to hide. He stopped by a fence, but a bluebird cried, This is no place to hide. They will find you here. You cannot hide behind a fence, said Gray Squirrel as he ran up the fence and looked at Pokey. Oh, I wish I were back in the woods, said Pokey. He turned and trotted away. So there's Pokey talking to the bluebird. But Pokey did not get back to the woods. He soon found himself in the town near the rodeo grounds. The streets hurt his feet. He did not like the noise in the town. He remembered the clown and the rope. At last he saw another fence, a very high one. If I could get through this fence, Pokey thought, I would be out of this town. But as soon as he opened a door in the fence, out came many, many dogs. Poor Pokey. Now he had to hunt another place to hide. Pokey went from one street to another. Far down one street... He found a big house with an open window. Looking in the window, he saw many little baskets. Pokey had come to a school, and the baskets held the children's dinner. So there they are. Pokey sniffed at one basket. He liked the smell in the basket. Soon he opened the basket with his mouth and cried, A big red apple! An apple is just what I want! Then Pokey heard voices in the house. He walked to another window and looked in. This time he did not see baskets. He saw many children. The children saw Pokey, too. There's the children looking out the window at Pokey. They cried, Look at the face in the window. A little burrow has come to our school. When the children ran to the door, Pokey kicked up his feet and ran away. Look, that burrow is a clown. See the red balloon on his tail? called the children. This time Pokey found his way out of the town. As he looked back at the town, he said to himself, What an adventure! I've been all around the town. How good it is to be back on the open road. Next we will read Strangers on the Road.